man, there's never been a more exciting time to be in the gaming industry. I'm told there are a billion gamers worldwide. There's 220 million in the United States alone. And hopefully we've got something for all of you guys tonight. Uh, but I always have to start my presentation uh, by reaching out to the people that started lining up on Friday at noon to be a part of this presentation. Millions of people watching around the world through our stream broadcast. You guys look forward to E3 all year long. There's nothing more exciting than eating up every piece of news and all the great gaming information that has to be shared. And when you combine that with a next generation platform once, that's a birthday and Christmas all rolled into one. So I want to thank you guys. Your motivation and your enthusiasm has really driven me throughout my entire career and this entire presentation is for you. So thank you very much. Woo! incredibly exciting year so far. In February, we unveiled the most advanced gaming system ever created with PlayStation 4. And since then, momentum and excitement across the industry has grown tremendously. Tonight, we look forward to revisiting why those of us involved in creating this groundbreaking entertainment can't wait to bring it to you. And I know you're all looking forward to hearing more about PlayStation 4, but there are more than 70 million people who want to know what's new on PS3 and PlayStation Vita. There's lots of exciting news to share on Vita as it approaches its second year in the market, and PlayStation 3 lineup is stronger than it's ever been. What's equally exciting, however, is transforming the PlayStation ecosystem into a stronger, more vibrant platform that enables people to engage, share, play, and connect on their terms. There's no better example of this movement than PlayStation Vita. Vita is just beginning its life cycle. Just over a year since its launch, we've built a library of more than 125 Vita dedicated games. And people have access to more than 650 titles when PSP, PS1, and PlayStation Mobile games are included. It's clear that people love Vita once they get their hands on it. In the US, Vita owners have on average purchased more than 10 games. And Vita customers also reflect a strong appetite for digital downloads, with nearly 60% of all Vita title purchases made through the PlayStation Store. The Vita vision hasn't wavered from delivering rich gameplay that you simply can't find on any other portable device. Vita is about tapping into an incredible pool of games through a system that offers dual analog sticks, high-def graphics, and amazing gameplay to deliver the best basic play outside the home. The platform will only get stronger in 2013 as the development community, especially indies and smaller developers, continue to expand its support. More than 85 titles will launch by the end of this year, including Batman Arkham Origins, Counter Spy, Destiny of Spirits, Doki Doki Universe. Killzone Mercenary. Yeah! And Tear Away. Yeah! We're also remastering <laughs> some of your favorite games for Vita. I'm pleased to announce that games like God of War HD 1 and 2, yeah! Final Fantasy 10 and 10 2, yeah! Yeah! as well as Flower oh, and Hidden Nation. Coming soon. Oh, oh. Shit. Finally, I know many of you are as eager to hear what's next for Telltale's critically acclaimed series, The Walking Dead. Yeah. It gives me great pleasure. Thank you. Gives me great pleasure to announce that the new episode, 400 Days, is coming this summer. 400 Days. We're bringing The Walking Dead to Vita in a major way oh, with a new bundle in August that comes with the complete first season of the series plus 400 days and other bonus content. As you saw in February, Vita will play a more critical role in our ecosystem with PlayStation 4. PS4 was designed at a system architecture level to connect to Vita. This means Vita gamers not only have access to the current 650 games, but they'll now be able to tap into a completely new library of PS4 games that can be played over Wi-Fi 
via the remote play feature. We're making Vita the ultimate companion device for PS4. As with all PlayStation platforms, we continue to bring the best media and communication apps to Vita. Skype looks beautiful on the Vita screen, as does Netflix movies and YouTube channels. Of course, we can't talk about incredible gaming and entertainment without highlighting PlayStation 3. As we head towards our seventh holiday season with PS3, our commitment is as strong as ever. We have a game lineup today that rivals or exceeds any of our previous year's offerings. Let's take a look at what's coming to PlayStation Nation this year from our worldwide studios team, starting this Friday with Game of the Year candidate, The Last of Us. Get another shot at this. I want you over. I'm working the fireflies one with you. I got some of the walk in the park here. 